These are, this is actually in human trials in Japan. Very exciting stuff. But there's something called USAG1, and it is a break on tooth formation. And what's exciting about that is that we actually have the potential to make a third set of teeth, or perhaps even more than that. And this USAG1 is a chemical that stops tooth development. And by creating an antibody to it, they're able to essentially suppress it. And when that happens, at least in animal models, those models start developing new teeth. And this is very useful because there are animal models that are don't make teeth, they're missing teeth. There's humans that also miss many, many teeth, and they are able to generate a, another set of teeth. The problem is it's not exact where you may generate a tooth in an area that you already have a tooth you don't generate every tooth 